When the news came through, we got excited. It was a very exciting moment to hear that South Africa has been recognized. The center in Hermanas has been recognized as the center for space weather for aviation. The second center is awarded to China and uh, Russia jointly. We are in South Africa doing it. And obviously what it means for us is that we have capacity now even to grow the center. I mean, we've had issues of aviation, flights missing and all those things. Now we become part of providing a solution and providing security for the airspace. I mean, it should give us an opportunity to bring more younger people into the center as part of training, as part of development, so that we create a next layer of the future so that the center can continue. I got approached last year by WEF, World Economic Forum, um, to be part of the AI Council. Um, out of that, we've been finally approved three politicians, which is myself, Theresa May, the Prime Minister, and the Minister of Canada. What it says to us is that South Africa is being recognized. The fact that we didn't lobby for it, I had that, um, I got feedback to say, quite a number of countries actually were bidding to be in the AI Council, were literally running campaign, full-time campaign to be in the AI. We didn't do that. We got recognized for our work. And that is extreme news. I mean, it's, it's fascinating. Part of what we do is to look at advising global community on the policies, the governance in the artificial intelligence environment. So we'd have to look at what are the best practices where, who has implemented good governance model around AI. Obviously in terms of looking at how do we enhance it, how do we make sure that it doesn't become restrictive or restricted. It's, it's huge, it's a huge task because one, and, and I say it's exciting and it's good because it means we will have first-hand information. And this is something that many of us would not even realize or know, that South Africa is developing new technologies. Uh, because the concept out there might be that, you know, we're consuming a lot of international technologies, therefore we're not doing much. So we have the responsibility to be developers of technologies. We have the responsibility to create new innovation. Our commitment is to say we will have to work hard to improve our rating, overall rating, which is critical for us as a country. But what I, what I must say, we the only African country that is being part on that, which is also quite good, uh, very few countries uh, actually open themselves up to, to be rated and evaluated.